In this Chatter High instructional video, we are going to go over how to view class details, progress, and interest. To get started, you can click on the View My Classes button, or alternatively, click on the Classes tab. On each class that you have created, there is a View Class Details button. Click on this button to further view the class. If you scroll down, you can see a list of all of the students in your class. If you are missing a student, you can click on the Add a Student button. What populates is a list of all students who have registered under your school. You can see the students already in your class and add any students that you need to. Please note that a student will not appear here if they have not created a Chatter High account yet. On this class list, you are also able to monitor if your student has hit the 300 question mark to unlock the recommendation report. This purple check mark signifies that the report has been unlocked. As a teacher, you have access to two different reports, the student interest and the student progress report. Let's take a look at the student progress report first. The student progress report automatically keeps track of student progress as they are quizzing. You're gonna wanna put a start date and an end date or else it will automatically just show the past week. Since this is a second semester class, we're gonna choose a start date of February 1st until today, and then click Run Report. You now have the class data. You can see how many questions the student answered, how many they got correct, and also how many were researched. This is a great indicator that the student is doing the work and going to the webpage to find the answer rather than guessing. You also have ability to export to CSV if you wanna play with the data. A lot of teachers will use this report to give the student an assignment. So they might have an objective of getting 300 questions correct and maybe that's 5% of the student's grade. All right, let's take a look at the student interest report. As you can imagine, our activity produces a lot of rich interest data. You're able to keep track of the aggregated interest data of your class. So in this case, business management, marketing, and related support services was the top occupation of interest for this class. This helps a lot of teachers in building lesson plans, or maybe it might help you to decide the next speaker you want to bring in for your class. Up here, you can filter any of the data as needed. 